Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in to another video. So I'm here in Walmart to do my weekend whiteboard or weekend warrior bonus, whatever it's called, um, for $5 to redeem 15 offers. And then we also have the September Sunflower bonus, which for me is $10 to redeem 42 offers. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Thank you for tuning in to my video. Please consider hitting that subscribe button and join my coupon family. And if you're a returning viewer, thank you for checking me out one more time. So the first thing that I'm going to start with is going to be on the the big easy reach, the Martha Stewart uh, lighter. You can either get this one or the Snoop Dogg. This is the only one that I saw that my store had. It's near the checkout. Um, so I went ahead and just grabbed it and came on out before I started picking up the other items. But I'm going to go ahead and pick this up at 397 submit to Shopkick. Getting back 920 kicks between scan and buy kicks, which is equivalent to $3.68, making the final cost just 29 cents. All right, you guys, so the first rebate that I'm going to pick up is going to be on the Luigi's Real Italian Ice. It's $2.87. I'm going to go ahead and use the 75 cent on front of coupon that's going to bring me down to $2.12. Then I'm going to submit to Ibotta, getting back a dollar plus a 10 cent any frozen meal rebate. Makes the final cost just a dollar and two cents. Next, I'm going to pick up the poise pads, the one right here, the 20 count at $4.68. I'm going to use the $3 printable coupon, bringing it down to $1.68. Submit it to Ibotta, getting $2 back, making the final cost free and a $0.32 cent money maker. So the next deal that I'm going to be doing is going to be on the degree motion sets, the men and the women's. So I'm going to pick up one of the men's here at $4.27. And then I'm going to come down here and pick up one of the women's also at four dollars and 27 cents so here are the two items that i'm going to pick up the total comes to eight dollars and 54 cents i'm going to use the one dollar printable for the men's deodorant as well as the one dollar printable for the women's deodorant that's going to bring my cost down to 654 then i'll submit to ibotta getting a dollar back for the women's as well as a dollar back for the men's but then i'm going to go ahead and submit to shopkick um, getting back 1160 kicks between the scan kicks and buy kicks and this does include the bundle So it's going to make everything free and a 10 cent money maker Next I want to pick up the Irish spring body wash. This is the 18 ounce. It's three dollars and 97 cents I'm going to use this one dollar coupon bringing it down to 297 But then I'll go ahead and submit to Ibotta getting a dollar 25 back plus all swag bucks There is a two set. There's two swag bucks, which is two cents for any brand body wash. So it's gonna make the final cost $1.70. Next I'm gonna pick up the Degree Massage um, bar here at $2.97. We have a dollar about a rebate, making the final cost $1.97. Next I'm gonna pick up the Soft Soap Hand Soap at $1.98. We do have 50 cent printables from the Soft Soap website. I left mine at home, so I'm just gonna do the deal without it. So I'll pay the $1.98. But then I'll submit to Ibotta. I have a 50 cent rebate as well as a 75 cent rebate attaching. So two separate rebates, making the final cost just 73 cents. Next I'm gonna go ahead and pick up the Don Power Wash. So I'm actually going to get the actual, um, the one with the spray and then the refill. So the total is gonna be um, $8.88 for the both. We have a $4.99 Ibotta rebate for picking up two. It should make the final cost $3.89 or $1.94 each. Next, I'm going to pick up this Raid, um, the Essentials. It's like the plant-based version. It is $6.98. I want to go ahead and submit to Shopkick. Between Sand and Buy Kicks, getting 1,515 kicks back, which is equivalent to $6.06, .06, making the final cost just $0.92. Cents. Next, I'm going to pick up the Renews It Cones. This is a repeat deal for me. They're $0.97. Cents. I'm picking up three for a total of $2.91. I'm going to use the buy to get one free coupon, which will take off 97 cents. I'll pay $1.94. Submit to Ibotta, getting back 97 cents for purchasing two. Making the final cost 97 cents, which is 32 cents each. All right, so has anyone else had any disappearing rebates? Because this morning before I came to the store, I had a couple rebates listed, checked them off. Like, okay, good. Here I am in the store about an hour or so later after putting everything together and those rebates are gone. So that's a couple rebates that now I don't have that I was hoping that I would. But anyway, I'm going to pick up the Pepsi mini cans. I'm going to get the Wild Cherry Pepsi, two seventy four. Submitting back to Ibotta, getting a dollar back, making the final cost a dollar seventy four. Next, I'm going to pick up the Ocean Spray Craisins, the one that has less sugar. It's two dollars and twelve cents. 
Then I'll submit to Ibotta, getting back $1.50, making a final cost of $0.62. Cents. Next, I'm going to pick up the ragu pasta sauce. I'm going to pick up three at $1.48. That's going to bring me to a total of $4.44. I'm going to use two of the $0.50 cent printables from coupons.com. I wasn't able to print a third one, so I'm going to go ahead and submit to the coupons.com app to get another $0.50 cents back. That's going to bring my cost down to $2.94 for the three. Then I'll submit to Ibotta, getting back $0.75 cents for each which is um, equivalent to $2.25. Then submit to Shopkick, no, Swagbucks, excuse me, getting back 300 Swagbucks, which is equivalent to $3, making the final cost free and $2.31 and moneymaker for all three. Next, I'm gonna pick up the boil in a bag rice. It's $2.28. I have a 50 cent rebate. Plus, since it's my second time picking this up, a 25 cent bonus, which will make the final cost $1.53. So here's everything that I'm going to pick up. I believe this is 14 rebates. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I need 15 to hit my bonus. So I will just do a pay with Ibotta, which will give me that as well. So I think this is going to be it. This should be enough to get me my $5 bonus. So let me go ahead to the register and check out and let's see how it turns out. All right, you guys, so here's my receipt a few hours later. Um, but here's the raid, the Bic lighter, the Renuzit cones with the coupon, the Dawn, the soft soap, the Degree, um, the Irish Spring with the coupon, the Ragu with the coupons, the Ocean Spray, the Pepsi, Success Rice, the Luigi's, the Poise, and then both of the degree deodorants. So I ended up paying $50.61. So I did go ahead and submit my receipt back to Ibotta, Shopkick, and Swagbucks. I didn't have anything for checkout 51. And I will go ahead and submit to Fetch to see if I can get a few points for that as well. So let's go ahead and talk final numbers. All right, so here is the final breakdown. I ended up paying $50.61 for everything. I earned back $25.29 from my Ibotta. So that includes all of my rebates, the $5 Weekend Warrior bonus, $0.25 cent success boil in a bag rice bonus, as well as $0.13 cents for using a pay with Ibotta. I earned back $3.02 from Swagbucks. That would be $3 for the Ragu, $0.02 cents for the Any Receipt, and then the two cents for the any body wash with the Irish Spring, it did not go through. I put it under review. If I get it, fine. If I don't, I'm not going to worry about it. It's just two cents. Um, and then I also will be getting back. Well, actually, I already got it back. Um, the $14.42 from Shopkick. And that would be for the degree, um, the Martha Stewart, the Raid as well as scan kicks and walking kicks. So that's everything together. And then 50 cents back from the coupons.com app for the ragu. So it makes my final cost $7.24 for the 20 items I picked up or just 36 cents each. So no, it is not a freebie, but I did have to kind of, kind of um, change around some things in terms of what I was going to be picking up because this particular Walmart was not fully stocked with some of the items that I would like to get for my rebate. Um, in addition, as I mentioned earlier, you know, I had a couple rebates that was there, checked, ready to go, did not have um, an expiration date or anything. And by the time I got in the store, they had disappeared. So anyway, not a big deal. I picked up some items that I could use, some of these food items. So I'm perfectly fine with how everything turned out. But yeah, guys, this is going to complete my Walmart Weekend Warrior um, haul. If you like these deals and want to duplicate them, please feel free to do so. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.